cats. We love them as pampered house pets. We see them curled up on our laps, chasing laser pointers and batting at toys. But what happens when these pampered paws encounter the wild world? For fancy cat breeds, life outside our homes is a whole different ball game. We're talking about breeds like Persians with their luxurious coats, sleek Siamese with their piercing blue eyes, gentle giants like Maine Coons, and the exotically patterned Bengals. These cats are bred for specific traits that make them wonderful companions. However, these same traits can be a disadvantage in the wild. Imagine a fluffy Persian trying to blend into a forest, or a Siamese trying to hunt with its loud meow. In this journey, we'll explore the challenges these fancy breeds would face if they had to survive in the wild. We'll compare them to their feral cousins who are perfectly adapted for life outdoors. This is their story, a tale of two lives, one of comfort and one of survival. Get ready to see your feline friends in a whole new light. Let's start with the Persian, a breed known for its luxurious long coat and sweet temperament. These cats are the epitome of indoor pets, perfectly content lounging on soft cushions. Now, imagine a Persian in the wild. That long, beautiful coat? It would be a magnet for dirt, burrs, and parasites. Not to mention the heat! Persians are also brachycephalic, meaning they have flat faces. This can cause breathing problems, making it harder for them to catch prey or escape predators. Their sweet temperament wouldn't help much either. Persians are not known for their hunting skills or their ability to defend themselves. In the wild, Persians would struggle to survive. They're simply not equipped to handle the harsh realities of life outside our homes. These gentle giants need our love and care to thrive. Next up, the Siamese, known for their striking blue almond-shaped eyes and their vocal personalities. These cats are highly intelligent and social, always ready to chat with their humans. But in the wild, being chatty can be a liability. A Siamese's loud meows would scare away potential prey and alert predators to their presence. Their sleek, short coats wouldn't offer much protection from the elements either. They'd feel the cold more than other breeds and be more susceptible to injuries. While Siamese are generally healthy cats, their lack of camouflage and their loud voices would make it difficult for them to survive in the wild. They'd miss their humans and their warm laps a lot. Now let's talk about Maine Coons, the gentle giants of the cat world. These large, sturdy cats are known for their thick, water-repellent coats and their friendly personalities. While their size and strength might seem advantageous in the wild, their gentle nature would work against them. Maine Coons are not aggressive hunters and would likely struggle to catch enough prey to sustain their large bodies. Their friendly nature would also make them vulnerable to predators and less likely to defend themselves. These gentle giants are happiest when they're with their families, enjoying a good cuddle. Finally. Let's look at Bengals, a breed known for their exotic spotted coats and their energetic personalities. Bengals are often described as having a wild look, but how would they fare in an actual wild environment? While their athleticism and hunting instincts are more pronounced than some other fancy breeds, they still face significant challenges. Bengals are accustomed to a certain standard of living, regular meals, fresh water, and a safe place to sleep. In the wild, they'd have to compete for resources and contend with dangers they've never encountered before. Their wild ancestry gives them a slight edge, but they are still domesticated animals at heart. To understand why fancy breeds struggle in the wild, we need to compare them to their feral counterparts. Feral cats are masters of survival. They have strong hunting instincts, are adept at finding shelter, and are wary of potential dangers. Feral cats are also more resourceful. They're not picky eaters and will readily scavenge for food. They're used to harsh weather conditions and know how to stay warm and dry. The difference between feral cats and fancy breeds boils down to instinct. Feral cats have a strong survival instinct that has been honed over generations. Fancy breeds, on the other hand, have been bred for companionship, and their survival instincts have been somewhat dulled. So, can fancy cat breeds survive in the wild? The short answer is, it's highly unlikely. These cats have been bred for generations to be our companions. They rely on us for food, shelter, and care. While we might marvel at their beauty and admire their unique traits, it's important to remember that these traits often come at a price. Fancy breeds are not as well equipped to handle the challenges of the wild as their feral cousins. Their true calling is to share our homes and our lives, bringing us joy with their purrs and cuddles. These fancy cat breeds form a connection with us that goes deeper than mere companionship. They sense our emotions, 
comfort us in times of need, and celebrate our joys with unspoken understanding. This bond is a testament to the centuries of shared history between humans and cats. It's a relationship built on trust, love, and mutual respect. So, while they may not be suited for the wild, their place in our hearts and homes is irreplaceable. Pause 2S. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe for more content.